Women who have accused Harvey Weinstein of sexual abuse are being offered a payout through the bankruptcy of the Hollywood company he founded. A U.S. bankruptcy court announced the ruling at the conclusion of a remote hearing. Judge Mary Walrath approved the Weinstein Company's liquidation plan that will set aside $17 million for those who say they are his victims. She overruled an objection from a handful of women who are looking to pursue appeals of their claims outside of bankruptcy court. Walrath said 83% of sexual misconduct claimants in the bankruptcy want closure. The Weinstein Company sold its assets to Lantern Entertainment, which later became Spyglass Media Group, for $289 million after it filed for bankruptcy in 2018. The bankruptcy was precipitated by widespread claims of sexual misconduct against company founder Harvey Weinstein. The film producer is serving a 23-year prison term after being convicted of sexually assaulting a former production assistant and raping an actress. Insurers have contributed $35 million under the plan, so holders of sexual misconduct claims will get almost half of that. The Weinstein Company's lawyers said the women who filed the claims could see six-figure recoveries. Under the plan, they can forego most of their payout if they want to continue pursuing their claims. A group of women with sexual abuse claims argued that choice is unfair. A lawyer for the company said during the hearing that the plan is a favourable closure of this really ugly story.